Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to transform the data from JSON to XML. So there are many ways how to transform JSON to, JSON to XML and depend upon the criteria we will be transforming the data. So out of them, the most best uh, transformation I have picked up and I am going to show in this tutorial. So if you have any doubts or queries or if you have any doubts regarding the data conversion, you can comment comment on this video uh, and send those details what your data and how to transform it into XML format <coughs> so in this MuleSoft application I am going to take a HTTP connector which posts the data of JSON a sample data I will be posting it and my HTTP listener configuration will be localhost 8081 then I am going to take a transfer message which converts from JSON to XML so there are two things here uh, if you want to convert the data directly you can just write the output here uh, like this or you can define the metadata taking as input so uh, if you want to define the metadata you need to create a sample JSON and a sample XML of your data so how your input will be the JSON save it in a dot json file and upload it you can do like this define metadata so add it will be something like json and you need to create a type and here in drop down you can keep it as json and drop down the schema and select example and select your json file so that uh, it shows the indentation of the json data then uh, at the output you can define the metadata you should be creating a sample output so for small data we can uh, define an output but for larger data we can go ahead with writing the uh, code directly on the output panel over here so in this data view example you can see there is an output as application xml uh, the input is directly as application for as well as json and so I have a sample data over here in the postman which I am going to post let me show you so there is a contacts tag where we have many contacts so each contact will have first name last name and hobbies so there is an array of contacts and in each contact there is an array of hobbies so as I said before there are many ways to convert the data from JSON to uh, XML uh, the best one which I have picked it up is uh, this contacts is the one the XML tag which we are going to place at the starting of the XML so uh, it can be contacts or anything see just remember whatever comes in blue color is something which we are defining okay so whatever you define here it will show in the output so here I am uh, the original data contains the name contacts so here I am mapping the payload payload.contacts in that I am contact uh, mapping each contact so my each contact will be he headed with contact tag so dollar symbol just shows the value of the particular field so make sure that your contacts name here the name of contacts and the original data contacts name should be same because it will be mapping according to the name that's it just set the payload so that you can find the output in the pay <coughs> you can find the output and a logger over here so it is already in running mode so I am hitting it you can see the data coming like this so contacts is the one which we have defined over here in the transfer message at the starting contacts so this will be named as the first tag then in context we have each contact with name first name hobbies etc so here you can observe there is nothing see in the original input data there is no second name in the first array so it is not showing up in the xml sheet so there, there is no need to keep any null conditions or something like that if at all you want to specify any null condition we can specify over there so uh, this is the best method way to convert from json to xml so if you have any queries with your data or you have any sample data which you want to convert to xml you need any help you can comment it out 
in this video and please don't forget to subscribe and more to come yet uh, so i started data view transformation videos from now thanks a lot